What is up, guys? Kendall here, and today I'm going to show you how to add special effects to Skype. First, you're going to head over to Google Chrome or whatever browser you're using. I personally suggest Google Chrome. It's amazing. Search for Cam Twist. I will have the link in the description for this. Click on the big download button and download. But I've already downloaded it, so I'm just going to carry on from there. Click on the download image. It should mount up here on your desktop. Open up the installation file. You will get this. Um, what you do here is you right click on it and click open. And it gives you an option to open it. Continue, install it on your computer, type in your password, whatever else is needed. Once it's done, close it and it should be in your applications folder. Head over to there and open it up. Alright, once it's open, you will have a bunch of stuff here. You have your studio which I'm not going to use now. You have your preview window and you have your main window. Alright, I'm going to head over to the main window. Over here you have your video sources. Desktop Plus is pretty cool. You can select a video file and play that through your Skype. You're going to need your webcam. So double click on that, it'll come up in effects and use. You should notice your webcam light come on. And then you have all your effects here. You're going to use one of these, so I'm going to select bubbles, double click on them. If you click on other ones, you can just click on the X over there, it will delete them. Now head over to your Skype. No. Blah. Okay. Now you head over to Skype preferences. Click on audio, video. And as you can see here, I already have it selected. So this is normal built-in eyesight. And this is Cam Twist. As you can see, I have lovely bubbles floating around me. You can eat them, I guess. And that's it. Close that and whoever you Skype will see that instead of your usual cam feed. Anyway guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more content. I'll see you next time.